Now, here's Chief Meteorologist Tony Petrarca with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. And some noticeable weather changes over the next roughly 48 hours in terms of temperature and precipitation. And speaking of rain, not much out there now on live pinpoint Doppler 12 radar. I see a few speckles of green going on by, indicating a, a light shower or a sprinkle. Though the trend, as we get into tomorrow, this should become more widespread and heavier, especially during the afternoon and evening. Talk about incredible. Uh, Thanksgiving a week away, upper 60s to low 70s. I mean, these numbers are 20 degrees above average. So the month of November continues to be very mild. It topped out at 71 with a little bit of bonus sunshine during the morning before the clouds took over this afternoon. Temperatures now have been holding in the middle to upper 50s, 54 to 57 in New Bedford right now, 56 in Providence and westerly coming in at 55. Now, initially, as the rain tries to work in, it really breaks apart, so there's not uh, much coverage to it. However, as we widen out the view, notice the area of green on the radar becomes uh, more solid and consolidated. And this is where a secondary storm system will be forming. So this line of precipitation, which doesn't look like much right now, will eventually organize itself into a storm system and pass overhead uh, tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening, bringing with it perhaps up to an inch of rain by tomorrow evening. Rain, no snow, and no surprise. I mean, look at the temperatures all across the northeastern United States with the lack of any t a kind of winter cold. So uh, precipitation will stay in the liquid variety as we check out the future cast starting at 11 o'clock tonight, showing occasional showers overnight. But notice by tomorrow morning, it becomes more widespread and getting a little heavier during the afternoon and evening hours. So this is 1 o'clock in the afternoon, and here we are tomorrow evening at around 6 o'clock. So it's not one of those things where it's a passing shower every now and then. It is a widespread, more or less all day kind of wet weather. So for this evening and overnight, not a lot of rain, just spotty showers, temperatures dropping through the lower to middle 50s, giving it the yellow caution light for travel tomorrow morning and even tomorrow afternoon with the wet roads and some reduced visibility. 51 to 57, the morning range and temperature. Right now, the game plan is to have the showers and rain light in the morning and then becoming heavier during the afternoon and evening hours. Temperatures mild though not in the 70s like today, upper 50s to lower 60s, including 60 in Coventry. Bay forecast has the wind turning uh, north and eventually northwest late in the afternoon. First it's southeast in the morning, then turning northwest in the afternoon at 5 to 10. Waves under a foot, visibility mile or less than some of that steadier rain. Upper 50s to around 60, 61 degrees. Cumberland and Johnston grab the umbrellas in the same situation out across southeastern Massachusetts with periods of rain not as warm and temperatures at around 60 degrees. Seven day outlook shows a lingering shower for Thursday morning, drying out in the afternoon, windy, much cooler, bright, chilly and dry for Friday. Temperature in the upper 40s. Weekend looks good. And once again, here we go with another warm up. Temperatures mid 50s on Saturday. We're back into the 60s under partly sunny skies on Sunday with a temperature at 62. So even though it turns cooler next couple of days, the cold air doesn't have any uh, long lasting stay in the the warmer air eventually takes over once again. So winter on hold for now. That's great. <laughs>